previously in the last video. Oh, look! Okay, now think about the amount. <laughs> what is this, man? And now back to the present. Since France is a traitor, for now we need somebody to operate the camera. Kuma. You, do you have any experience in cinematography? I need a cinematographer once. Eh, good enough for me. You're hired as our new cameraman. <laughs> okay, so we'll start with... Ugh. Damn it, where the fuck is China? Probably held up by your ridiculous order. Why don't you just eat something if your blood sugar is... Oh, whatever, we'll start without him. We'll start from the part right after everyone finds out Germany's alive, okay? Action! Okay. I... I can't fucking believe you're alive! How? I somehow managed to get lucky, and it only looked like I got hit by the train! I laid between the tracks, basically evading, getting run over in a similar manner as someone under a car but between the tires. Despite the fact that the hydraulics and other dangerous metal parts of the train are low hanging, and there's no doubt that they'd tear my skin and give me severe burns, if not kill me if I was underneath the train. I somehow managed to survive completely unscathed. Ah. <sighs> uh. Uh. Anyways, let us commence with the clownery. I mean the cure. Cure? Wait, 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 cut! Canada? Didn't we get you a new costume? Uh. Go on, we'll wait for you to change. And while we're at it, we need to fix the lighting. Sweden? Yes. Oh no, Sweden can't fix the lighting. Uh, I'm reassigning you to gaffing duty. Concentrate the lighting closer to where the actors are on stage, please. Okay, I'll do my best. He's gonna drop 80 lights. Hmm? I'll try moving this one to the left. Uh-oh. Ouch! That's a bit bright! Sorry, I'm having trouble seeing where the... Oh, much better not too bright. What the fu- Sweden, are you okay? Yeah, just uh, fell. Oh dear, you look quite hurt. We should get you some first aid. It's fine. He says he's fine, so he's fine. Rub some dirt in it and let's keep rolling. Okay, and action. Oh god, they gave Canada a maid's outfit. No. Cure? How will we get a cure? Ahem! <sighs> yeah. Simple. I've traced down the source of the Picto infestation. The massive nest that contains their entire colony, as well as their queen, happens to be conveniently located about a mile from this town. A, a mile? How isn't this town overrun with them? Convenience. We have to prepare ourselves for the siege of the pickle though, Hive, and prepare for an encounter with this queen you speak of. It's going to be a fucking rough ride for us. If my predictions are correct, which they are bound to be due to the nature of the situation we're in for some reason. Since that means that the Picto Queen has a fluid sack inside of her that contains the antidote to the Pictonian transformation. Okay. Weekend of making the human turning to of the back to the human? Yes. Hmm. Oh, he can't talk at all, I just remembered. This discovery, it is important. Ugh. Oh my god, the face. But Germany, it's bound to be super duper scary in there. What if I get scared? That's just the risk we're going to need to take. If we can find some way to get out, get out of this hell. 
It truly is hell. Uh, Canada, Russia, England, Italy, and America. Two of is making the preparations. We go. <laughs> okay, that take was all right. People are gonna ask why Canada is suddenly in a maid outfit. Let's see how you did. I hope that whatever cinematographer you absorbed your powers from had a basic understanding of the rule of thirds. This, this fucking camera is pointed at only half of the actors. Yeah, I'm too small. I can't reach it to fix it. I can't reach it to fix it, says the incompetent fucking bear. What did you just call me? I called you. No, I am tired of this. This discrimination! Good day, sir! Aw, oh, he's so cute when he's mad. God for dumped! And he is not. For fuck's sake, how the hell can get it get any worse? Yep. So goes the last ca person who could operate the fucking camera! Hey, hey, you're going to surpass my world record for most times the word fuck was said in a day. Maybe chill out for a fucking second? Romano! Uh, <laughs> Please be quiet. Okay. Shouldn't we get Sweden some medical help? Drag him outside. The protesters probably have a medic. Consider it a firing. Okay. But don't tell him I said that. He'll probably be too concussed to remember anything, so just tell him that he quit. Then he won't want to squash me like an ant. He probably won't, but okay. <laughs> Time to go outside, Mr. Sweden! Besides the camera being pointed at a weird angle, most of the footage from this take seems alright. Wait! The boom is in the shot for the latter half of the scene! Would it fucking kill you to hold up the damned microphone higher? He's short! Well, it's kind of hard for me on account of my scolio- God fucking damn it. This is what I get for hiring a stupid kid to do such an important job. <laughs> you know what, Prussia? Go fuck yourself! Hope you look shitty on you! <laughs> By the way, I'm taking one of your letters! Wait, what? What?! This is going to get confusing. You ought to fix that. Oh my! I've never seen someone's big mouth and grouchiness screw them over this much. And I'm friends with Romano, so that's saying something. We should just get back to our hotels for the evening. It seems like this recording's a bust. We are filming the next scene. Get to your places. Oh, Prussia! But this has better be important. Also, where the hell have you been? Uh, recovering from a panic attack. But I'm okay now, and yes, this is important. You can't film that naked America scene! Why the hell not? Listen, the fan base is not going to like it. But you said they do like him naked. Which one is it, huh? Have some fucking consistency. Uh, it's... Uh, I can't explain, but I promise you that if you film that scene, bad things will happen. I'm not taking it out. I already spent all day on the script rewrite when I catered directly to the fan base. Under your advice, might I add? I am telling you now, do not film that scene. It will actually cause a mass extinction event. Philippines. Chill. Okay, everyone. We're going to film the next scene. America, be prepared to strip in the scene after this one. Aye, aye, Captain. I've been practicing my de-pantsing speedrun. <laughs> I've never seen it called like that before. Don't say I didn't warn you.
It's a poster, not a pull door. Oh. I warned you. <laughs> okay, 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 it's fine. It's just us now. But it's fine. You look like your heart's about to give out. It probably is. Let's just continue it with the next scene. Since we don't have a boom operator, we'll just have to make do. Hopefully the sound quality isn't affected. It will be. Trust me, I'm an engineer. Germany, shut up! Okay, so I know I don't have any lines in this next scene, but... No. Oh, damn it! Next scene, action. Hmm. <sighs> There's something on your mind. You look like a person. There's something on your mind. Germany, I, I feel so tired. Tired? Tired of fighting, damn it! I'm tired of fighting. I'm tired of dealing with these, these, these fucking monsters. I can't take it. Oh no, do not cry. I just can't take it. This place is hell. It's hell. We're going to make it. All we have to do is find Umkill, the Picto Queen. But how do we know where we're going to actually be able to do that? We just summoned people against thousands of those fucking mutant beasts. Don't give up hope. Hope is all we have. I know things may seem grim, but a part of life is trying to survive and beat the odds. I would rather die fighting them, sniveling and cowering. Mm hmm. Um, I said I would rather die fighting than sniveling and cowering. Bruder. All of the pictos went on strikes, it didn't say. I just make pretend we'll add it in post. Okay. Ah, I am being attacked. Oh shit! D Germany! Ah! Oh god! The pain! Ah! Romano! Never forget me! Never give up hope! No, damn it! No! No! Don't leave me! What's going on? I heard a scream! He's dead! He's dead! Those fuckers got him! At least misery of him is now no longer. No! But what cruel god! Did such a horrific turn of events even begin to be conceived? I feel nothing but the horrific pangs of misery and grief. We shall avenge our fallen friend by commencing forth our mission to liberate this world from the shambles of. Okay, cut. I can't fucking handle this shit. Glenn, where's the crying? About that, I can't really cry on cue. Listen, I know you're pissed, but there's not much I can do about that, mate. I've tried everything, including getting punched in the gut and thinking about my dead mom. You can at least try! At this point, I don't think it would be worth it to put in the effort. The production's already a mess. Why would I want to waste any of my energy trying to add such a small detail? Because it's a fucking movie! You're supposed to deliver a performance that makes somebody feel something! Regardless of how you actually feel. It's stupid! Half of these creative choices are stupid. Focusing on this crying bit doesn't allow my actual fine-tuned acting skills to shine through. What acting skills? You haven't delivered a believable performance in this entire fucking production! I think you just don't know what good acting is. It would explain a lot of what's going on here. I can't even explain that you ranked high enough on the fan polls to get brought back. I can't believe that the fans can even stand to look at the motherfucking... Oh my god. <laughs> I was starting to lose my voice there. Oh, England! Oh... Jeez, did Prussia give a lecture worth worse than the three-hour lecture from Canada to America? God damn! 
cold as hell. <laughs> Great! Now I can feel me crying and splice that into. <laughs> Moves. It's fine, we can just uh, skip his lines. Hello, I have an idea. I want to say an idea. Yes, it's really. How about you give me his lines? No. Eh. Uh. Are you fucking kidding me? No. Now let's continue filming the. No. No. We are not finished talking about this! I get all of my lines, all of my lines, completely removed! Then someone who is too incompetent to handle the role gets axed, and you don't fucking let me take over! I'm on the front of the poster! The front of the movie poster! I should have all of the lines, you absolute failure of a man! Oh, fine! I'll get you, let you take some of his lines, happy? Nope, you lost your chance. I'm fucking out of this bitch! Holy shit, he broke. What a diva, jeez. Oh, and Romano? I'm going to do things you wanted me to do. The things you can't do! I'm going to go downtown, and I'm not going to sleep until I've caught every available venereal disease within the 15 mile radius. And I'm going to have a lot of fucking fun doing it! Losers! <laughs> Holy shit! He flipped everyone up! Was he taking this medication today? Uh, probably not. Mm, okay, enough with the chatter. We have to prepare the set for the invasion of the Picto Hive, then film that scene. The crew never finished making the set pieces for that scene, so. I suppose we have to improvise. Let's just build the new set quickly. Hopefully it won't eat into our recording time too much. Holy. Poor thing. I think he's got some kind of concussion. And he's got some cuts and bruises. That's wonderful. An on-site work in Joey will definitely make the public scorn the production. But it's still bad that he got hurt. I managed to clean up his wounds, and he's probably going to be fine, but I think we should get him to a real doctor at some point. Uh, Ukraine, how is he? He holding up? He's doing better than he was when Russia delivered him. Right. Uh. Are you okay? You're looking worse than before. <laughs> yeah. I... I'm okay. It's the fifth time you puked blood today. Are you sure you're okay? You're gonna die, bruh. Just... Just get on with the protest. I'll go rest off. Off to the side somewhere until I feel better. Mm, I should probably start now. Hopefully it will empower the crowd. Rance, can you watch over Sweden for me? So sing. If I don't feel a boss, I will give him mouth to mouth immediately. If his ghost consents. That's not how first aid works, but I admire your spirit. Attention, everyone! I would like to share a few words with you all. I wanted to thank you all for coming. Our demonstration may have only been going on for a couple hours, but I really think we've built a sense of camaraderie. I feel the energy coming from all of you. I think, I think... Uh, I think it's the most wonderful thing in the world. I'm so proud of all of you. So proud of all of my dear friends. Aw, oh, sweet. What the? Oh no. And I hope that you all have found some things from the strike that have benefited you as well. Before this protest, I had not a penny to my name. I'd gambled all my money away. But now, thanks to Thailand's loose pockets, I have three nickels in the vomit-soaked rag. Holy shit, he's dead! The intense work schedule and constant retakes were making me turn into a feral beast. 
bent on breaking the bones of everyone within three feet of me. Now I'm drinking boobs robbed off of my friend's corpse. I had to clean up various bodily fluids left behind by members of the cast and crew. Now I'm surrounded by a bunch of loud people who would probably fail a urine drug test. The latter is somehow more pleasant. Before this protest, I had to do work. Not that I don't have to do work, and that's good. I was given the workload. That would be too much for even three people. But thanks to the protest, I... <coughs> I got to make a sign and march around! I haven't seen Axelop since the protest began. So I can only assume he's having fun too. Uh, guys, I think I killed him. He wouldn't listen to the drama church, even though I know more about this franchise than he does. He doesn't even care about the production. He just wants to be a power-hungry asshole. Before the strike, I had to detach myself from reality and pretend I was married to a beautiful woman in order to give any sort of meaning to my life. But now I don't have to pretend anymore. I was finally able to achieve that dream. You married? You got the girlfriend? How long did it take to program her? But wait, what the fuck? Exactly! He actually has a legit girlfriend! And I think it's wonderful that we can all band together as friends to make each other feel more respected. Ah, Ukraine, you're so nice. Let's keep this good energy going, everyone! He's a great spokesperson. Beautifully spoken. It was from the heart. Hmm. Where, where am I? You're outside, dear. Russia delivered you after some accident happened on set. Actually, they left a letter for you to read when you woke up. Sweet, Sweden, sorry for tossing you out like an old sack of potatoes. After you knocked yourself out, Russia fired you and then told me to deliver your corpse to the rabid protesters. Blame him, not me. Much love, Russia, heart. Oh, I've never been fired before. Oh, well, it's okay. You may not have your job anymore, but you have us. You can join our protest. Mm, not sure about that. I still feel dizzy. Don't worry about all of the marching and stuff while you're hurt. Just stand here and be our moral support. Speaking of marching... I should go check on our lovely protesters. Alright, let's start with the people who got fired or quit recently. I never got to openly welcome you to the protest. Latvia, you too young to be drinking that? Where did you even get that? Did Thailand give it to you? Huh? No, I found this where he hides his stash, though. You need to put that down, you'll get your liver! Uh, it's fine. I can hold my liquor. I usually down a bottle of brandy at night. There's something wrong with you, young man. I'm over there. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. Latvia, he actually doesn't know what the term drunk is, so... I wonder where the two actors went. Oh well. Make sure everyone feels included when you check up on them. Okay, I'll do that. Has this brought us danger to our life, my dear Cuba? Yeah. Maybe? I don't really know, to be honest. I think I missed half of it. You missed it? Where did you go? I don't know. The protest started. And suddenly it's two hours later and I was in the alleyway with my hands covered in blood and a bunch of random teeth in my pocket. Pretty weird, right? Yeah. You're an expert with protests, right? At what point in the protest do the violent blackouts stop? Uh, they stop in, uh, stage three? Uh, okay. When do we get to stage three? Eventually. Mon ami. You look positively radiant. Thank you. You look so much better without a giant cloud of smoke around you. Uh, right. What a wonderful demonstration we have here. 
Aren't you excited to be a part of it? Uh, is there something wrong, mon ami? I am trying to enjoy my freedom from Russia and the need to cope with my stress, but I feel so shaky. I can't stop shivering. I have a horrible headache, and I just feel so, so uneasy. Ah, uh, I understand your issue. He's experiencing side effects. What's the issue? Where I am from? We call it nicotine addiction. Oh. I need a cigarette. Oh boy. <laughs> what are you do up to doing the protest, Hungary? Uh, not much. Besides losing three grand on digital rummy on mobile. Nah. You can earn that money back in a few months, right? That was the money I was going to pay this month's mortgage with. Oh. Mm. Oh, go. Good luck with that. Are you enjoying yourself, my friend? Long death, mana. Na 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 um, I'm not sure. I don't speak Thai. I think he's too drunk to speak any other language. Zabai, Zabai. But neither of us have money. And even if we did, I'm pretty sure his BAC is near comatose levels. I, I thought he would go back to normal doing the protest. Apparently not. And at least he's having fun. They're punching... This? Oh, it looks like Prussia. <laughs> ah, what are you making here? It's my masterpiece! I made it out of sticks and scrap metal and things I stole from the studio. It's the manifestation of my hatred for this man. And I think I... Uh, wonderful, just wonderful. Such nice craftsmanship. And I like the tiny drops of fake blood on it. It gets our message across much clearer. Fake blood?! That's no fake blood! <laughs> I pricked my finger on the jagged footages! Jeez, did it hurt like crazy! <laughs> I actually think I might have caffeinated beverages. But he doesn't need to work anymore. Why does he still need to abuse energy drinks? My assumptions is that the kid's symptoms of caffeine withdrawal are too severe at this point for him to stop without his heart giving out. Or he's too in to want to go to sleep. Or no. I'm going to go check on the protest. Take care of yourself, yeah? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, yeah, sure, okay, yeah, sure, well, of course, yeah, sure, of course. Oh, no. <laughs> hey, I'm not here. What brings you to our protest, Kuma? Pressure's a butthead. Ah, finally, someone here who really gets it. And then, if you press the X and B keys quickly enough, you can glitch through the wall. Then that'll shave like two minutes off of your runtime. So many people use that technique, but I actually pioneered it. <laughs> wow, I have a thing or two to learn from you, Estonia. Huh? Did you need speedrun techniques? I could show you my way around, around the keyboard and mouse. Uh, so that's what that means. I don't do computers. Thank you for the offer, though. Poland is on the phone. Maybe he's dissing out some juicy gossip on a malign director. Hey, I don't know why you're not picking up the phone, but I, I miss you. I know you're mad at me for something, but you shouldn't be because I'm perfect. But, but perfect people make mistakes sometimes. I don't know what I did, but I think I'm sorry. I just want you back. Go see him. Gee, Axlov. Oh, hey. Hey. I'm going to go. I need to call a priest. <laughs> How are things going, Philippines? Oh, hey, they're going great. I feel so calm now that I'm not in charge of sifting through hateful spam comments on our official movie account. And I can express my anger with Prussia by giving the fans ammunition against him. Oh, that sounds wonderful. Yeah! Hey, an unrelated note? 
Do you happen to know Crush's home address? Uh, why yes, I'll send it to you. You doxing him? Fantastic! They'll need it. Mm. 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 <laughs> mm. Uh, well, at least he's alive. Good day, my dear Delphi friend! Oh! Hey, hey! How's things going? Oh dear, you're missing three fingers! Yeah. Uh, should should we find them and stitch them back on? No, no, they're already gone. G gone? Yep, I was hungry, so I deep fried him. <laughs> Why? Waste not, want not. Cube already hacked him off during one of his weird blackouts. <laughs> yeah, it hurt pretty bad too, but he came to right before he was about to hack the other ones off. It felt real bad and started apologizing. Once I mentioned eating him, he helped me make the breading. Real nice guy! Uh, well, I suppose that not being wasteful is an admirable trait. Oh no! Uh, I think I talked to everyone I could talk to, except for this lady. Yep, okay, now I talked to everyone I could talk to. What do you want? I want to hear what's on your mind, Belle. Are you happy with this protest? I suppose. I've only torn my hair out one time during it. Uh, that's uh, wonderful? The only wonder is how we haven't stormed the Bastille yet. I don't think Prussia has noticed nor cared about our protest. Uh, I'm sure he has. The man on the other hand will have people left. We don't need to resort to extremes quite yet. <laughs> I can pass through the sign! Oh my god! How oh, are they doing? Oh, uh, they're doing well, I suppose. That's good. They seem so happy during the speech. It seems the stubborn Brit has finally decided to join our movement. <laughs> He's ignoring me? Hey, what's with the lack of vocal response to my existence, hmm? Leave me alone, you cretin! Why are you crying? How nosy of you to ask, but if you must know, Prussia really knows how to hit someone who it hurts. But you're so prideful. What the hell could he say to you to make you this emotional? Did he insult your lack of culture? Your horrible fashion? Your subpar tan dancing? My tap skills are not so far. I know none of those. What did he say then? <gasps> he called me ugly! <gasps> no, that's a low blow. That's too far, even for me. <laughs> he said I had bad teeth and, and my face looks like it's been busted in. Ah, um, that's not very nice. And then... He said I look like a burn victim that was lucky enough to get skin grafts. Wow, hush. And he said I look like a plague victim that's been marinating in the River Thames. Okay, okay. And he said my mom probably couldn't tell the difference between me and the afterbirth. England, I get it. <laughs> Aw, yes, yeah, it's okay. It's not true, right? Um, England, everyone is born a certain way, and that's okay. You just have to have pride in who you are, even if you are very humbly. <laughs> yep, actually right for once. I should just accept myself as I am, and I won't feel sensitive about what he said anymore. Hmm, he said China isn't to something productive, like, I don't know, a strike? If you wanted me to join you, all you had to do was ask. You didn't have to pretend to care about my well-being. I wasn't pretending! It was the most fun. <laughs> oh, there he is, Venetiano. Hmm. Italy, have you also decided to? Can't talk. Going to go have an orgy out of spite. I hope you 
that he'll be all right. Spite all G's never end well. Oh my. Russia wants me to get as much picto blood as possible. And he wants me to make picto eggs, whatever the hell those are. Both of those things are under the umbrella of special effects. I'm pretty sure I should head there. Okay. Well, the movement seems to be going alright. Special effects. Man, they trashed this place before they left. Oh gosh. There's not much left. I hope we can make this work along with the eggs. Wow, this is okay craftsmanship for only having 10 minutes and a bunch of random wood pieces and leftover white paint. I was not aware that the little boy with cat ears could use power tools. A pleasant surprise to be sure. I know my way around a home improvement store, despite my, uh, feline attachments. I have those picto eggs he asked for. I think he just wants them scattered around the set for effect. Okay. Is this what you guys came up with? Yes. Let's just keep filming. Yeah, I mean, it seems alright. Okay, we're going to start from the scene of everyone infiltrating the Picto Hive. P Russia? <laughs> Wait, what? Get to your places. And action! They left the front door unlocked. We should keep our guard up. Ugh. Be a watching where your feet are go. Eggs plentiful. Ugh, it's fucking disgusting in here. Growl. Ugh. Ooh, what was that? I'm super duper scared. Yeah. Kill me. Big those are near. Little coward cat Canada will be reduced to mush. We have to be prepared to fight. Let's just hope those abominations didn't see us come in. Gasp! Oh shit, where's my fucking gun? We need to fight it with our pecs. Uh uh, flex. Ugh. Eep! I don't want to die! Rawr! No, don't touch my brother. America! No! Not my brother! <laughs> I can't do it anymore. Go on without me. I will find my way out. Kill the queen and. Damn it, we have to chase after them! Are you deaf? America is safe to continue on, so we continue. No, we have to look for him. We can't take on the queen all alone. He's correct. Okay, but if we die on rescue mission... Oh wait, sorry. Ah, I'm so tired that I accidentally got the wrong voice. Okay, but if we die on rescue mission, the Italian man is for to blame. Cut. Okay, let's move on to the next scene. This is starting to look more like the room. Ready? Just give me a second. Oh no. And Germany, please at least fucking try to make it believable. No promises. 
I just love watching everything cry. There, nice and breezy. Ah! What? Let's make this scene quick. This costume smells like someone shat on a corpse. And action! There is nothing you monsters can do to break me! Grr. Ah. I don't care what you throw at me. I can take it. I can't believe this. Mm. There, there are no instruments of torture here. How am I supposed to do a torture scene with no instruments of torture? You're gonna torture him while you naked? Just use your fucking imagination! Use the egg and shove it in! Oh god. Prepare yourself, puny human. <laughs> Dude, stop! That tickles! Never. You will endure Pictonian torture via tickle. <laughs> dude, dude, <laughs> not the ribs. Dude, I'm gonna be. <laughs> mm. Ah! Hot. What was wrong with that take? Was there an issue with it? Was there an issue with me using my imagination as you instructed, dear brother of mine? Just. Just go to the next fucking scene. We'll find some way to fix it in post. Good. I don't want to be hotboxed by several months of caked on man stench anymore. Action. This hive is so fucking big. How are we going to find him? I don't know. It will probably take forever. Holy shit, America! What have they done to you? They've broken me. Me up tickles. No! Not my brother! You will have to unbreak for to kill Picto Queen. Rub dirt in psychological wounds. Cole, cole, cole. He unlocked him's restraint. I'm so cold. Yeah, I can tell it's shrinking. But we should thank God you're alive. Now we can take down the Picto Queen and end all of this bullshit. Cut! Okay, now we need to film the confrontation with the Picto Queen. This scene is really important. This scene might be able to make up for your blunders early in the film. So you really need to put this shit out into Kai gear. Uh, I have a question. Should I still keep acting like a coward, despite the fact that we are at the climactic final battle? Absolutely! Okay! I also have a question. What is this coal? Why do you have me saying this? It isn't slang for drugs, right? I don't want to encourage my fans to do bad things. I don't know what it means, but it's probably fine. Um, are they talking about K-O-L? I also have a question. Enough of the questions! Just keep your stick the same and don't change it, okay? 